two ghouls and a zombie. Um, however, um, I do think that I'm gonna need to heal up blue just a little bit, so... Luckily, um, I just, uh, have to use the Cure 2 spell a couple of times on her. So, um, in the actual battles here at the end, um, now I'm gonna start using Cure 3 and Cure 4 over, uh, Cure 2, so... You're gonna be using, uh, Cure 4, uh, Cure X, and, uh, Redo X a lot to me up, uh, Basically, because it's the end of the game, so no surprise there. So, but um, you know, this one uh, should be open for us. Oh crap! Oh, <laughs> yeah, I see, but I did wrong. Um, I'll have to go back and close the uh, one over uh, the the last one that I actually did. Uh, way over on the right, so, um, I am, uh, gonna go, uh, flip the switch over there, and I will, uh, just beat you right back here, so, um, I'll be right back. And, uh, back, and, uh, I can't believe that I forgot about this one that I had, uh, get again, uh, over here. Just another ICU. Um, Man, I ran into a lot of them on the way over to the, to the right one and uh, on the way back, so... <sighs> Blue, um... I, I'm lucky that Blue has uh, so many AP points. Uh, and that uh, she has the evil cane, or else... I would uh, have to be using uh, a lot of acorns on there, which, uh, which would really suck at this point, so... Of course, uh, I could uh, always go for more, but yeah, oh well. So, and now uh, we can uh, get up here and uh, get over to the uh, next action to Natalie and uh, Buzzer. So uh, now I can actually head up to uh, the next actual section of uh, the floor I was on. So and. With the flame dagger, um, if you want to, um, you can equip it on Karn. Um, if you uh, find the icy dagger to uh, still be a little better, um, stick with it. But uh, I think overall the uh, flame dagger should be a little more powerful. So. I, I like the little extra action with him, so... Because eventually we're gonna start to run into some really uh, fast bosses, so... But... Yeah. Don't have real far to go here, so... Two ghouls and uh, it left a tea drop for me. So um, this place, um, it, it really isn't very long, like uh, in structure. Um, however, it, it does seem to take a while because uh, we do have a couple of enemies that we've got to fight that are uh, actually pretty long in their battles. So, but um, I don't think that. Uh, this next actual section of the floor is as bad as the one below, so... Okay. Alright. Uh, this, uh... This looks kind of ominous. Um, yeah. I would, uh... Normally heal up, um, however, um, from what I remember with the story, um, we're going to be knocked down to uh, one hit point each uh, right after this anyway, so we're, we're just going to have to heal up after that, so. Yeah. 
Yeah. For some reason, uh, it not only blocked us, it sapped a lot of our strength. Some. Some damage. Well, it nearly kills us. Boy, we're a pessimist, aren't we? Um, no, I, I don't think so. Um, I guess that's really nice of you. Sometimes. Yeah. Before we uh, actually head up, though, we have definitely got to heal, so. Um, I think I'm gonna use a couple of Cure of Fours, um, and I'll uh, probably use up the acorns that I have. Um, I will uh, be right back. And I'm uh, back in a. Uh, if you uh, really wanted to face uh, the next actual boss with Agni, if uh, if you picked it up, um, you could uh, probably go with him. Um, however, um, I do find it uh, a little easier with uh, the ritual and puka forms. So, um, but uh, let's, uh, here. I should say thank you to my sis. Just said that, but jeez, ah, you know, considering we just talked to you like two seconds ago, you could actually have said it then. But what now? Oh, well, yeah. 